Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is Sunday, November 13th, 2022. I'm the Drunk Poker Root Test Beer Time. Uh, another uh, box set, gift pack, whatever you want to call it. This time from our pals at Amsterdam Brewing in Toronto. Um, it's, it looks like that. There, there are beers in it. It comes with four bone shakers. I drank two of them already because degenerate. Um, but it comes with... And, and do I need it? No. Do I want it? Yes, a ceramic bone shaker mug. Look at that thing. That thing is freaking. Uh, I am a sucker for gimmicky mugs. I really am. I can drink my coffee out of this once we're done with this. I have a sawdust mug and an Amsterdam mug because that's a big mug. So four beers. It's like twenty bucks or whatever. It, it was, honestly was. Uh, I bought it. I bought it because I because I want to because I indulge myself and I like bone shaker. Bone shakers. One of those transformative beers. I remember years ago I did a, a video talking about like eating citrus and trying to help identify the flavors um, from Bone Shaker, actually. And it really was. It was one of those beers that helped me understand why I like big, ridiculously boozy, like bitter IPAs. And uh, yeah, so here we go. We're going to drink out of a drink from the skulls of your enemies. <laughs> I mean, it's not a beer that's, again, this is an old, you know, the Amsterdam has been around for a long time. Yeah, they sold to this is a Danish brewer or something this year. I don't care. Crap beer's dead. We all know that. What? Don't tell the people that. I keep telling you, don't say that. Anyways. And bone shaker's bone shaker. They're, they're, and, and we found this with something that goes up and down, right? But uh, I think it tastes fine. It tastes great. And it's weird to drink out of a giant mug like this when I can't, like, see the beer. But that's okay. Cheers, my friends, to buying gift packs for yourself because, hey, you've got to treat yourself. Cheers. Now, much like its cousin, Fracture, the king of the hops, and then other Fractures that just come out for no reason, Bone Shaker is a big, bitter beer. Um, I certainly think the recipe has, it's dialed in, um, big, toasty malt back, um, bitter, bitter, orange, grapefruit, like pineapple, resinous pine. This is not one of those beers that's like, oh, you know, it's okay, it's, in the, it's not middle of the road. It's aggressively hoppy. It's aggressively hop. I like that. This is my style, West Coast IPA, um, and drinking it out of a skull mug. This is a heavy mug, by the way. I got to like full hand it like a toddler, just like. Nah. And granted, if you drink all four, this comes in at what seven one. Yeah, seven one. So if you drink all four, you might need two hands. But I mean, I feel very important now. I feel like I'm on the news or something like hey, today in the news, uh, drinking beers in the basement on a Sunday. So let me see it. You know what? If you have a friend who's who likes, you know, big hoppy beers, for lack of a better word, this is a nice gift. And maybe it's just a nice gift for yourself. And then you get a nice new coffee mug out of it. Help you take on the world. Use this mug when you're in your Zoom meetings there, you work from home, peoples. I, I'm not work from home. I have to work from work. I would like to work from home. Anyways, Poke loves you. Buy yourself a gift. Get yourself a treat this year. Why not? Treat yourself. Cheers. And the nicest thing is... It takes two to fill it, so gotta have two at a time. Winning all around. 